Hello and welcome back to our channel. This is Abhinav. In this video, we will talk about the problem C of code forces group around 16, which is max max cut. So in this problem, this is similar to the B problem, but in this problem, it is given a matrix or a binary matrix. So what we have to do is, uh, there is we have to find the maximum max by dividing this matrix into some sub matrix. Okay. So means uh, dividing these matrix columns into different columns. So basically, what uh, is given here is if a matrix contains only one. Then the max of it will it will zero. If if it contains only zeros, then the max will be one. And if it contains zero and one both, then the max will be two. This is the logic behind the max concept. So so for discussing this, I have already copied this test case in my whiteboard. So I will discuss this test case. So no, I have not copied. I will copy here. So this the the, the test case is zero one zero one zero zero zero. Okay. So the test case is the first string is zero one zero one zero zero zero. So let's write here. It is zero, one, zero, one, zero, zero, and zero. Okay. And the next string of this test case is one, one, zero, one, one, zero. So one, one, zero, one, one, zero, zero. This is the. This is basically our input. Okay. so what we so first of all let's uh, let's observe a pattern that if there is a uh, matrix where 0 and 1 both are present then the max will be 2 and it is the maximum possible max it is the maximum possible max so whenever we will find a column with 0 and both then we will just add 2 to the r answer like here it is 0 1 so it will be a separate matrix with 2 it is 0 1 it will be a separate matrix with 2 the case is when there is 0 0 when there is 0 0 then the max of 0 0 will be 1 and the max of 1 1 will be 0 the max of 1 1 will be 0 fine okay and in case the max of 0 0 1 1 1 2 because 0 1 both are present so we will so in this case what we will take we will take this one we will take this one we will not take this one means a separate if they are present adjacent to each other then we will take as this a, a single matrix because the sum of 1 and 0 is just one and we are getting here two and we have to find the max of max like this in this case we will not take as sim, as a separate we will take is as a sorry we will take it as a single matrix and the max will be two for here we can't take it so we will take it as single it will be 1 and it will be 1 and the sum is 8 and that's the answer of the test case this is what i uh, we are doing here okay so let's move towards the code part that how, how i have done this so this is my code part you can see it so what i've done is first of all i have uh, uh, just uh, converted that string into a uh, uh, array Okay, into an array because it the the input is in the form of a string. Then I have checked. Then I have checked that is both the columns. I mean, first I have checked that is both the means both the numbers in a single column are not equal. If it's not not equal, then it will be zero one or one zero. Then we have just incremented two. I have just incremented two. And if they are equal, then I have stored in another array that they are equal to what? If they are equal to zero, then I have put. st is equal to 1 why 1 because it it can contribute 1 to the max and if it is 1 means both the numbers are 1 then the max will be 0 then st is equal 0 basically we are we are uh, uh, doing here max we are adding here max and if we have already counted the max here then i have making the st minus is equal to minus 1 so by doing this what i am what i am doing to find is i am to i am uh, finding the adjacent 0 0 and 1 1 so that i can take both that uh, as a single matrix instead of the separate matrix okay so this is what i have done here that if sti is equal to 0 and sti plus 1 is 1 means there is 0 0 0 and 1 1 1 then i will take them as a single matrix and then increment to in our count variable this is what i am trying to say and i here i have done i is equal to, equal to n minus 1 and this uh, separate because to uh, to uh, uh, means to ignore the Uh, to prevent the lower bound uh, error okay i was getting a lower bound error that's why i have done it and then i have output the c the value of c 
this is what i have done so if you have any problem with this logic you can comment down or you can also join a telegram you can ask us there you can subscribe to the channel for code uh, for code for this course solution for uh, community programming content thank you for watching the video i will like it thank you for watching thank you thank you thank you